The man hit the leader, John, with a blow to the head. This enraged John. He held them back with his own bite. He shouted at them to get out. With John's bravery, John's bravery, the residents upstairs started throwing flower pots to keep the outsiders away. They finally worked together to disperse the outsiders. People began to cheer for John, and they praised the representative. Soon, the flat block was under systematic management. The men went out in groups to look for supplies. But it was during one of these trips, they were threatened at gunpoint by outsiders. Fortunately, Jack was able to sneak up behind them and save them. Whenever there was danger, John would always be at the front to protect the group. And so the Aborigines returned home with a full house. Life in the flat block is getting better and better, with plenty of supplies. On this day, the residents had a party to celebrate their success. But in the middle of it all, a girl walked in. She confirmed that she was the original resident of the building. Mary and lies in room 903. 903 is John's neighbor. John's face fell, but then he happily introduced Mary to everyone. 